Good morning. So let's continue talking today about the whole idea of seeing all your life as a teacher. Um, if, the, if the point of being in this life is has a purpose, there's a purpose to why we're here, then one would sense that, uh, that life itself is our teacher. It teaches us how to evolve and see what works and what doesn't work and, and then choose from the hardest how to progress. So if life's here to be uh, giving you a lesson and you're, you're the student, taking that observer role as student can be really valuable. So what would life be teaching you? Well, the the lessons that we're here to get, some of the most powerful lessons, can only be learned by seeing the opposite of what it is you're being challenged to integrate. So if you intend to have courage, then the universe is going to put something in front of you to test that courage. And it's not going to be something that's pretty and easy and simple. Um, how, do we be, how do we become more loving? Well, sometimes we... We get to put in front of us something that looks very hateful, and we choose to go in a different direction. Um, maybe something uh, is put in front of us um, to move beyond an addiction or uh, the, the kinds of attachment to running the same kind of relationship over and over and over again, the same type of person uh, who might be giving you the same kind of an abuse. Um, so, all of life's a teacher. The stuff that doesn't look pleasant is simply an opportunity for you to choose a loving response to it. That's all it is, nothing more. The more and more we can get the simplicity of this and practice from the heart, uh, the more beautiful life will appear to be and become. It's all beautiful. Everything in front of us. Because it's either outwardly beautiful and loving, or it's an opportunity to respond in a loving way. Please take this one into your day again. And see how consistent you might choose to be about that today. Good morning.